Good afternoon. Good afternoon. First of all, I would like to just thank God for allowing me to be here with you today. My name is Debbie Hardy. I am a homegrown uh, citizen from Halifax County. I've been here all my life. I'm married to William Hardy. We've been married for 35 years. I have, we have two children. I have a daughter that teaches in Durham County. She's a music major. I have a son that's an upper band coordinator in Wilmar Day. I have three beautiful grandchildren. That's my heart as well. Uh, I've been on the school board for May 8th will be 20 years. I'm a member of the Pleasant Hill Missionary Baptist Church where I am a faithful member. I also serve as president of Halifax Health Inc. I'll, I'm also retired from Abbott Laboratory with 30 years of service, which is a pharmaceutical company. And I also volunteer for CAM, Shalom Area Development Association. I'm a strong advocate for the boys and girls here in Halifax County. <coughs> I'm a strong advocate for supplemental tax because I feel our children deserve it. I'm a strong advocate for doing what's right. And I'm a strong advocate for respecting someone, even though their opinion might not be like mine's. I also would like to say that I'm so happy that we all have one thing in common, is that we want what's best for the boys and girls in Halifax County. And like Ms. Johnson said, people read about what we're doing and what we're not doing. And in, if, in hindsight, if we can see things differently, I'm sure all of us would have possibly done things just a little bit differently. But it is what it is, and we're going to continue to do what's right for the boys and girls here. On May 8th, if it's in your heart, vote for David Hardy for the Halifax County School Board. We're going to continue to work hard. We've done a lot um, to get us where we are right now. We're moving in the right direction. And we just need everybody here to support each other, because it's not just about us. It's the whole count. Thank you, sir. Good afternoon, I believe it is. And uh, one thing that I have learned since I've been sitting here is that 60 minutes go that mighty, mighty fast. Uh, I'm Karen Hawkins and um, was um, married to the late Theodore Hawkins, and we birthed um, three children. And um, we have two daughters and one son. And we still owe Sarah May, but we have gone to see Uncle Sam. Uncle Sam can help us to pay off South Bay. And um, I was born and raised in the Darlington area on the uh, other night, and I mentioned the word Buzzard Town. And if any of you are as old as I am, you have heard the word Buzzard Town before. And I remember when growing up, and I was going to Pittman School, and one of the teachers said, how many of you live in Buzzard Town? And I was afraid, I was ashamed to raise my hand. But now I am so glad, I'm very, very, very proud to say that I'm a native of Buzzard Town, North Carolina, which is now Darlington, North Carolina. And um, I've been raised on a farm all my life. I know farm work. I know what it is like to um, have farm work. I'm an educator, and I'm a retired educator. As a matter of fact, um, I've been, as a matter of fact, I've been around. And I, <laughs> I've been around a long time. Um, I worked in Halifax County Schools. I worked in Brunnick Bradford City Schools. I worked in Burnsy County. I worked in uh, um, Northampton County. I worked in Rocky Mount City Schools. I worked at the College Preparatory Schools. I, were, I have had affiliations with the Academy Schools. So I have been around and I have learned a lot from all of them. All of them have definitely been an asset to me. Uh, of course, my heart is right in the center of Halifax County because this is where I'm from. Um, I believe in the children, I believe in the boys and girls in Halifax County, and yes, I believe in the saying that goes, all children can learn, and they will learn when given an equal opportunity that we will learn. I know that, that we have had some struggles, but what we're going to do is take these struggles, and I know you've heard this cliche that says, we're going to take this lemon, we're going to take this lemon and make lemonade. We're going to take these stones with these rocks, and we're going to make stepping stones out of them, and I uh, appreciate your vote in the main primary. Thank you. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. My name is Charles Esbell. I was born and raised right in Holliston, Holliston, North Carolina. And I reside in Greenwood down in the Enfield community. I have, uh, I'm a single parent. I have three sons. Um, I have three grandchildren. And all, uh, I work at uh, 
Carolina Plumbing Supplies and outside sales. I am also a member of the Greater Joy Baptist Church in Rocky Mount. I'm a member of the Rose Mount Pastor Shrines Club, and I'm a member of the Union of Lodge number 64 as a 33rd degree mason. And I also solicit your vote on May 8th. I, I want to, I think uh, boards need to go in a new direction. If elected, I will do my, I will give you 110%. If not, I will support the superintendent and the board members <coughs> or elect. But I will do my, uh, do the best that I will possibly can and I will pray and solicit your vote on May 8th. One in college as a pharmaceutical science major, two in the Halifax County Schools, middle school, elementary school. I am a graduate of Shaw University, Cambridge College, and North Carolina State University. I am certified to teach AIG, special education, and I'm a K-12 certified K-12 administrator. Also, I'm an adjunct <coughs> instructor for Halifax Community College. If elected to this position, I'm committed to improving the quality of education for our children in Halifax County. I'm committed to establishing a system that is, that is consistent, a system of controls for physical and academic accountability. Also, I believe that when quality increases, then the quantity will also increase. I solicit your votes on May 8th. And I will do everything that I can to make the quality of education in Halifax County equal that our children will receive the best. For we produce nothing but the best and the brightest children from Halifax County Schools. Thank you. Good afternoon. I'm Gladys Lawson Walden. I'm a retiring educator. I have worked both as an English teacher and as a guidance counselor and retired as a guidance counselor at Weldon City School have worked 20 years in Halifax County Schools. I've also worked as an adjunct uh, teacher at Halifax Community College. I am married to James Walden. We, between the two of us, uh, we have three surviving children. We have two grandchildren, and we also have two great-grandchildren. I would like to solicit your vote and your prayers, and thank you if that's what you decide to do on May 8th, uh, I have served for four years. I think that I have been a productive member of the Halifax County School Board. I'm not sure that I can attribute all of that to me, but I know that I think I have carried my load there. At one time, I had the opportunity to serve as the vice chair. I have also served as the chair of the curriculum committee. I found that to be quite an enormous task, but making sure that we were following the standard course of study. I also want to let you know that currently I serve as the chair of the uh, policy committee and I also work with the finance committee on the school board. I am committed to three things and they are the county goals for us. I want to see the achievement to continue. It is improving. The fiscal management has improved. We're, that's number two. And number three, we want to have community involvement. I solicit your vote, and I also solicit your participation and cooperation in working with the children of Halifax County Schools. Thank you.